Well, a big issue before the Montana legislature, Medicaid expansion. Currently, this provides government-funded health coverage to 95,000 low-income adults. And so far, there are two competing proposals. But as MTN's Mike Dennison reports, there will soon be a third in the mix. Democratic State Representative Mary Caffaro of Helena has already introduced her bill to continue Medicaid expansion as is. And Republican Representative Ed Buttry of Great Falls will sponsor a competing bill, likely adding some additional requirements for eligibility. Now, Republican State Senator Bob Keenan of Big Fork says he's working on a third bill that will focus more closely on eligibility and health outcomes. The eligibility needs to be tightened down. We should be looking for results, health results, uh, work results. We're trying to get people that are eligible for Medicaid expansion and have them graduate from the program. Keenan says the bill will require the state to take a closer look at applicants' residency and income. He says Medicaid expansion has done a lot of good in Montana, but that he and fellow Republicans want it to be a program that helps people improve their health and get out of poverty. Governor Steve Bullock has spoken out against work requirements for those covered by Medicaid expansion, saying they're too costly. As for other restrictions, he was non-committal on Wednesday. So, certainly want to take a look at all the ideas out there um, and not drawing any lines in the sand by any measure, but let's, let's actually make sure we're working together to try to improve it, uh, not set it back. Keenan says he's looking for a way to tighten up the program without getting in a big political fight. Going through the process right now of whether I want to put something that's going to end up being a third rail and cause a big emotional upheaval over that. Buttry said Wednesday he's still putting the final touches on his bill and believes it may address many of the concerns identified by Keenan. We don't know yet precisely how these two Republican bills on Medicaid will differ, but we do know they'll both try to tighten up the program and get the Democratic governor to sign one. At the Capitol, Mike Dennison, MTN News.